Are people gonna think it's his girlfriend? Oh, maybe not. Uh, well, here you have one of the main streets of the capital. Oh, Grace turned tour guide. You can take one of these side streets to reach the residential areas. Whoa! It's huge! Yeah, I guess you could say that. From the front gates here, you can go all sorts of places, like the Nation of Water. Oh. But there's not really that much to see here, apart from that. So what do you say we move on? <laughs> do you think we could just walk a bit slower? Yeah, I don't see why not. And then maybe we can hold hands. <laughs> Saw that coming. Sweetheart? Sweetheart? <laughs> Sweetheart? Who? Grace. Uh, hmm? What's the matter? Um, how about we uh, don't hold hands, okay? <laughs> what? Why not, sweetheart? Is that the sweetheart? So it would seem. <laughs> they are not helping. <laughs> Let's get out of here, Tinon. Wait for me, sweetheart! Holy crap, he booked it. Jesus. Hey, how's the rest? How's it going? You can't just say that. This should be far enough. <laughs> What's the matter, sweetheart? Why did you run off like that? Look, Tinon, about this sweetheart stuff. <laughs> Look, you see, you think you could, you know, not call me that anymore? Uh, then, you mean... Do you see what I'm talking about? Uh-oh. I have a feeling this is gonna go the wrong way. Oh my! You should have said oh, something! Oh no. I had no idea! Well, I'm glad we had this talk. Oh god, this is just leading to a bigger misunderstanding. Too early? Uh -huh. you? But if that's what you want, sweetheart, then I can make it happen. Hey, Tenon? Yes, my love? Oh, no. <laughs> <laughs> well, that's one hell of a promotion. <laughs> my love? Oh, jeez. Than sweetheart. Then what should I call you? Well, I don't know. How about my name? Oh. Look, I just. It's weird. I mean, you and I aren't exactly. You know. You're terrible! How can oh, you no. Say that? Oh, no. Oh, no. Ah, it's just making Chris look even worse. <gasps> Naked? <laughs> I love this game. <laughs> Naked? Fuck it up. But, uh, well. Oh my god. Can't believe she said the forbidden word. Yeah, well, well, that was. Uh, it, it, was it was just an accident. I didn't. Now he's just making excuses. Okay, okay. You can call me sweetheart. You can call me whatever you want. <laughs> just get out of here. <laughs> told me anything about this train station. Some stuff happened and now the trains don't run. The end. Now that's the kind of story I would tell. That's how I would describe a place. Now go! Oh! Wait for me, sweetheart! Wow. I love the two people that are always just <laughs> off to the side. Finally. It's like, <gasps> naked? so tired. All I've been doing is showing you around town. <laughs> well, maybe it's all the running. I think the reason I've had to run all over town is the real problem. Yeah. I don't get it. You should have just not tried to get her to stop saying sweetheart. Uh, don't worry about it. Really? 
So where are we? The library, I guess. Are we? This does not look like the library. It's got a lot of books and it's uh pretty famous, I think. There aren't very many people here. Yeah, well, can you blame them? Reading about history is pretty boring. So what do you want to do? Go in? I'll bet Mel's in there doing some kind of research or something. Being Mel. To be honest, I don't really read books and stuff much. I guess you might say I'm more brawn than brains. You too, huh? Oh, so you like to get physical too, Oh my too, god, why? Sweetheart? Why did you word it like that? Yeah, swinging a sword around's way easier than slogging through some book. <laughs> I guess we've got more in common than we thought. Yeah, I guess we do. Well, we don't want to disturb Mel, so we should probably be moving on. Yeah. Then again, we've kind of already seen everything there is to see here. To be honest, I'm a little thirsty from all that running. I think you're a little thirsty for some other reason, too. Well, you want to go hit the tavern? I bet they'll have something for you. Yay! I think that's the end of the, the day off. Oh, man. Well, here's the tavern. Bet you've never been here before. <laughs> Come over here, girl. Oh I'll God! A good time. Wait, isn't this the same three guys from before? Do you mind, gentlemen? Oh wait, they're talking to the girl behind the bar. I think, maybe. I'm not entirely sure. You are disturbing the other customers. It looks like the person on the right is wearing an apron, so I would guess they're a girl, but I'm not sure because the speech bubble is pointing towards them. Other customers. What other customers? Huh? Oh man. Oh, it's them again. I thought as much. They look kind of gross. Yay! Not so loud. Huh? What was that? What'd you say? Ah! I think she just calls you gross. Oh, hello, Grace. I just sent someone over to the guild a few moments ago, but you had other business here, right? Hmm? Yeah, I was just feeling a little thirsty, so I thought I'd stop by. Grace? From the Mercenaries Guild? I've heard that name before. Hey, you're Grace the Sitting Duck. Yeah, <laughs> I know you. You're that nice guy who's always giving money to the less fortunate by losing at cards. <laughs> I thought I'd seen him before. <laughs> oh, that's great. You think maybe he'd be willing to donate a little money to our cause, huh? How about a game, buddy? I mean, to be fair, we have 150,000, so... Slinging a thousand toward them wouldn't exactly hurt. Sorry, guys. I don't play anymore. Oh, don't worry. We won't bother cheating against a chump like you. <laughs> or maybe you're just chicken, huh? Think I'm scared, do you? Well, prove it. Pull up a seat and empty your pockets. Oh, there's not enough space in here for all my money. We can play as long as you like. Let's go, Tin On. Oh, running away, huh? <laughs> Does that chick look familiar to you? Yeah, she kicked all your asses. Yeah, she kind of does. <clears throat> Let him talk. We got more important stuff to do. That gambling crap is in the past. I think I smell some bullshit. Oh yeah. Still <laughs> sure you want to run away? I got a bad feeling about this. There's something behind him. Something dangerous. Yeah, that's one way of putting it. Sorry to bother you guys. Let's go, Tin On. <laughs> Is she gonna beat the rest again? Hey, hey, don't be like that. Why don't you stick around, huh? We'll go eat on you. Don't be such a girl. Girl? Did you just call him a girl? <laughs> uh oh. <laughs> All right, you bastards. That's it. Hey, the battle music. <laughs> you. Damn 
How did they not see her? How dare you treat my sweet Grace this way? You? No, no. Are you the girl from... You! I recognize you! You idiot! You didn't recognize me till now? Too late for me to regret that now. It seems I wasn't clear enough last time. <laughs> Perhaps you need another lesson in manners. Oh, no, 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 no. We've definitely learned our lesson. Hey, hey, hey guys, bow! Do it now! We're really sorry. <laughs> we promise not to do it again. So, um, could, could you please, please let us go this time? Well, they sure changed their tune. Didn't take much either. I, so. I went easy oh. on you last time. Now you're going to learn what real pain is. And they won't sit straight for a week. No! When I oh, magic. Throw my enemies into the sky. Shutar Vito! Oh, please, like... Blow them out the window. Ah. Yeah, it's that same pose. That felt good. It gives me a warm, fuzzy feeling inside to know I've done the right thing. Now, shall we be on our way, sweetheart? Uh, yeah. <laughs> yeah. Is that the end of the day off? There we go. So that's pretty much the whole town. Holy crap! Yeah, I guess so. Sweetheart, is this wall here? Yeah, the Wall of Lamentation. We still call this place the capital, but it's been a long time since a royal family bought it. Oh. I wonder, what could have caused this sort of collapse? For a long time, the Nation of Water was one of the most prosperous, powerful countries in the world. Well, I'm sure the story is all about the White Tower and the Sword Surter. But it all boils down to a bloody war. Maybe people made up all those stories about gods and demons so we wouldn't forget about the past. Of course, anyone who knew what really happened's been dead for a long, long time. So who knows what the truth is? Mm. Still, I think sometimes people worry too much about keeping a country around. It's not about the country, you know. It's the people in it. Sure, the city's full of low lifes like yours truly, but it's full of great people too. The kind of people who didn't care about my past, that I spent most nights broke, passed out in the gutter. So what if the country's gone? The people are still here, and they seem to be getting on just fine. You're right. Yeah, I know, big talk coming from a guy like me, but that's what I believe. Well, you make a lot of sense, but you got one thing wrong. You're not a lowlife. Just one? <laughs> Things are looking up. Seems like most of the time I get everything wrong. No, I was just trying to say that, well, you're not the lowlife you seem to think you are. What you're doing for Sophie is really great. Would a lowlife do that? <laughs> well, maybe you're right. I guess maybe I've changed a bit after meeting Sophie and Mel and you. And here I am, doing something that matters. Hmm. Oh, man. Kind of went off on a tangent there. <laughs> Sorry, I didn't mean to bring up all that crap. I just have trouble sorting out all the stuff that's going on in my head sometimes. Oh, sweetheart. You're not gonna ask. Really? You don't want to hear about what happened to me? Why I'm like this? <laughs> no. No, I don't. Well, that's a surprise. I was expecting you would. I had a comeback ready and everything. <laughs> I'm happy to wait until you want to tell me. That's so. Well, I guess the time has to come someday. When it does, will you listen to my story too? Sweetheart, are you... Aww. What a cliffhanger. Alright, so now I think we're on to... Like, to go to what? The last gem. Oh, I believe so. How are you feeling, Sophie? I rested a whole lot 
out yesterday. I feel great. Hooray! All right, let's head to Bloom Island. I think the best way to get there is from the tower on Krupp Coast. That's right. All right, this is the last one. Stay focused, Sophie. Okay. Oh, damn. So, we're going back to the Krupp Coast. It's been a while. That's where we went for the first uh, gem, I believe. Yeah, it was the first dungeon. Where am I going? <laughs> Some reason I thought that's where the shop was. Now, I want to stop by the shops. Just because we haven't been in a while. I don't know if there'll be anything new. Might be able to buy some new stuff for, um... Fade. And maybe Sophie as well. Let's see. Yeah, we have a red bandana. Oh, these are expensive. Woo! Right, what else we got? Silver mail. That's really expensive. Anything else? Gauntlet. 11,000. Sheesh. I'll oh, just a quick Chris. There we go. Oh, she can use the battle glove. The bunny ears. Defense plus 40, speed plus 20. Could give her the bunny ears. She uses plate mail. Oh damn. Hmm. Right, okay. She's also level 39. Okay, so get rid of that. Now what else we got? We have stuff for Sophie. I was going to say which would probably be that. The Maron Beret. Okay. Princess Tiara. Ah, oh, oh, the black... The black cat pin. Oh man. Floral dress. Okay. What for bracelets? Platinum. We might as well just buy for everybody. Right, for Melrose. She usually wears robes, don't she? Sapphire robe. Not even her. Um, Defense is at 400, which is really high. And then another Platinum bracelet. I keep forgetting I can just stay on this. So for Tanon, is there anything else you can use? Wind Guard! <gasps> Whoa! Rest Guard. Okay. I think everything else for her is pretty much sorted. Right, Patty. Wait. Where are the cloaks? Oh, it'll be over here, here. Ah, with a holy symbol. Let's go with the light cloak. And then another platinum bracelet. And then finally, fade. I don't know what she can use. I might actually buy another black cat, uh, black cat pin for Sophie. Not sure though. Silver mail. I guess I'll just buy another gauntlet too. Wow, I'm nearly out of money. Sheesh. Floral dress, platinum. Platinum. Sapphire. Oh yeah, the black cat pin. Wind guard. Platinum bracelet. Oh, she's already wearing the platinum bracelet, that works. Alright, gauntlet. And then silver mail. Bunny ears can stay on sod it. And the tax seal. Ooh. And a dark stone. I can give her the sunglasses. Yeah, sure. Alright, now I can just sell everything. 
Do I not have any? Oh, they're not accessories, that's why. And I made back barely anything. Sheesh. I'm getting rid of anything that's three or lower, I guess. Yeah, I'll get rid of all these. I got these from all those bloody crystals. And they just constantly kept dropping it. What the hell's the royal pudding do? 75% MP? Holy crap. Not bad. I made back quite a bit of money actually just from selling stuff. Not too shabby. So the question is, do you get to choose who's in the party or is everybody just together at once? And then you just choose who you want to be with. By the way, to the Crypt Coast. Shouldn't be too bad. Yeah, it's the easiest place to get to. You just go down. And boom, we're basically there. So that tower must be the place that we couldn't get into at the very beginning. Mm -hmm. Oh yeah, it is. You can actually see it on the map. Never noticed that before. Yeah, it's right here. Ta-da! Oh yeah, I tried to open this door before. Wouldn't budge then either. Hmm. But don't we have to go through this door to get to Bloom Island? Sophie, may I? Oh, sure. Oh, Mel can open it. Estimated me. Such oh my god. Simple magic will never stop me. Can you undo this? Well, perhaps with a little help, yes. I've had my eye on this tower for some time, you know. I've also done a great deal of research on breaking magical spell walls. For a wall of this level, I don't think I even need magic to get through it. Just punch it really hard. You sound like a thief. We don't know what Mel is, aside from the pervert. How rude! Have you ever used magic like this? Uh, I, um, visited some ruins that were not strictly open to the public. Um, <laughs> anyway, uh, this isn't the time for that. We need to open this door, now! I had a feeling this wasn't the first time you'd broken into something. Um... Anyway... Let's just open the door. Hey, who cares? As long as we get to where we need to be. Is, oh, whatever. Anyone will do. Yeah! And there we go. We did it. That's the spell? Just go in, shall we? Hmm. Whoa, what? This place is huge. So, this is Krupp Tower. <laughs> I can smell the magic here. Mm. <laughs> treasure, treasure. You sound like a pirate. What did you say? Look at this gallant face and voice! Your face is scary and I can't see voices. <laughs> <laughs> this feels like a picnic. Well, I guess that's one way to look at it. That's right! Let's have fun with this! Alright guys, let's go! <coughs> okay! Alrighty, let's do this! Oh yeah, I never actually bothered looking into this. No. I know there's a way of like turning off certain magics. I just never bothered really doing much. Yeah, I don't even know how you would do it. You know, launch a ball of fire. That's how. You press triangle. Okay. 
So I could basically make it so that Sophie doesn't do anything. I could do the... get rid of that. Get rid of that. Okay. Regenerate out. Okay. HP, don't need to do that. Purity. There we go. <laughs> Sorted. I never thought to do this. Yeah, I think I'll get rid of both of those. Gravity's pretty good. Grand Magus, Magnus even. G gigantic fireball that hits multiple enemies. Yeah, just do that. Geos, don't need. Geo shield. Geo sword. There we go, she only has three spells now. The help heal all allies within a certain distance. That's a really weird spell. Don't care with that. Don't care for that. Vintos. Vinto. Shootos. Throw a spear shrouded in wind. Create a gust of wind, then attack with a spear. Sure. Mmm. Oh yeah, rebirth. Aqua bomb I don't want because she constantly uses it. Yeah, I'm, I'm fine just having her on, like, heal. High repair. Oh. Yeah, just go with repair spear. Sphere. Mirage claw. Phantom claw. Geist claw. Watch what dead enemy in attack does dark damage. Sure. I never really thought to press any, like, to press triangle. I'll have Fade do mostly attacks. I'll have her set to the same as Tinon. Yeah. Which was that. She doesn't have recovery, so I'll just do three. Oh, she always does the same as Chris. Oh. I'll just have her set to random. <laughs> Sod it. There we go. Cool. Hooray! Ooh. A royal pudding. This place is huge. Wow, this place is huge. What the hell? Are there any enemies in here or not? I can only guess that there aren't. Oh, we did it, I guess. I don't like how quiet this place is. There are enemies! Who am I fighting with? Oh crap, Sophie. There we go. Yes. There will be none left to pick up your remains. God, so what's how much XP is Sophie gonna get? Twenty-three thousand. Whoo! Hey, they level up. Yeah, I don't know if I want Sophie. What's it? I could do. Well, I, I, I kind of want to try out Fade. I'll do. Let's go positions. Oh my god, I can actually do this! Oops, there we go. Yeah! Now that... is uh, one hell of a setup. <laughs> hell yeah! Just the front line of melee fighters. There we go. God, I'm just gonna constantly be hearing Fade shouting stuff. Also, Sophie's just stood there doing nothing. <laughs> yeah, I don't mind. I'm mostly doing this just so Sophie gets some levels. Cause she fell real far behind. <laughs> just looks funny. Just stood there doing nothing. Hey! An Apollo D Harp. What does Magic Seal do? Oh. Sure. Why not? The Magic Harp increases intelligence, I think. Um... I, I can enable some of these. Requiem, that's the one that does damage over time. Mm. God, these are so expensive. I'll have Requiem enabled. She'll probably just constantly sing now, but whatever. It's fine. Boom. Alright, let's go. There we go. 
as I thought. Holy crap! Wow, she is a lot quicker. Doesn't really do much damage. I think it does ten percent. It was doing 